Hello and welcome to Alex's View Scope. Tonight's episode, uh, I'm Alex, uh, sorry I forgot to mention that. Yes, I'm Alex, I'm your host. Um, this is a Thursday, uh, let me explain that, um, these Thursday, uh, videos and podcast, well, the videos on YouTube will be coming out, um, on Thursday, Thursday night, um, the reason for that is, um, yeah, I have to work, and, um, <laughs> and, yeah, it's more age-appropriate for, like, um, adults, and I notice, um, people over the age of, like, 25 to, like, 45 have been watching these videos, um, so thank you to whoever you are, um, I really appreciate it, um. We do have it on a podcast um, called uh, Alex's View Scope, just like the um, the uh, YouTube channel. So, <laughs> anyways, tonight we're gonna talk about uh, Joe Biden, Nancy Pelosi, and uh, Donald Trump. Um, then we're gonna talk a little bit about cars. Um, I don't know how long this uh, video podcast is going to go on for. Um, you know what? I didn't really have anything. Um, normally I have some, something. So I have to work on that for next week. Anyways, uh, yeah, Joe Biden uh, tested negative for COVID. He's coming out of isolation. He says he'll wear a face mask for the next um, 10 days. He said that yesterday, um, Wednesday. Yeah, I think Wednesday. Um, yeah, so, and he gave a speech, uh, he said, he kind of gave, like, a, um, like a speech. Yeah, it was a speech, but he kind of gave, like, a, uh, example of, you know, like, um, like when the virus first came out, um, Donald Trump caught it, and, um, he had to be flown to uh, Walter Reeve, I think that's what it's called, Walter Reeve, uh, Medical Center, um, uh, that's because, um, they didn't have the vaccines when Donald Trump got it, so, uh, this time, uh, this president, uh, Joe Biden got it, um, he did not have to go, he did not have to be hospitalized, um, and it's amazing how, uh, both presidents, uh, worked during the, um, while they had COVID, so, that's, um, it's good, um, yeah, but they didn't have the, uh, vaccines then, and, um, so, yeah, I, you know, and regardless of how you feel about these vaccines, I'm not forcing it on anybody, um, you know, it's, uh, I don't know, <laughs> it's, uh, you know what, I'm gonna stay out of that, um, yeah, but, yeah, it's, and they're both boosted, I mean, they're both, um, they're both vaccinated, Donald Trump and, uh, Joe Biden, so, yeah, you got the, Donald Trump got the, uh, vaccine after he, um, after he had COVID, um, Biden has been, vaccinated, uh, about three times, or four times, or, uh, I'm not sure, um, but yeah, it's, um, Biden got less sick than, um, than Donald Trump, uh, so, and, uh, yeah, I think that this strand of COVID is not that serious, because, um, <laughs> I didn't want to say this last week, um, I actually, uh, tested positive last week, and that's why I was doing things around the house, um, and I was fine, um, yeah, I just, you know what, I had a, had a fever, and, um, and I'm vaccinated, um, and boosted, but, um, yeah, I just had, like, a fever and stuff, uh, I, I, you know what, now that I think about it, um, my muscles were also aching and stuff, um, 
during this. <laughs> so, yeah, I wasn't too horribly sick or anything. Like, I, I was bored at the end of this. At the end of the five days, I had to basically stay home. Um, and I... The only place I went was, like, the, um, out on the porch and stuff like that. But, yeah, I tested positive, I mean, yeah, I tested positive on a Wednesday, and I tested negative on a, um, Friday. And, uh, yeah, and then I retested myself, like, two days later, it came up negative, and... So, yeah, it's, um, it's kind of highly contagious right now, so... I don't know how that's going to look in the um, winter months. Um, <laughs> it tends to really take off. Um, I don't know how it's going to... I know you're not supposed to talk about this on YouTube. Um, well, I don't know the degree that you're allowed to talk about this on YouTube. But, yeah, let's uh, move on. And, <laughs> and uh, yeah, don't take what I say... Uh, likely or anything like that so so yeah donald donald trump uh gave a speech at the capitol um it was his first um it was his uh, first visit to the capitol since he left washington dc um and he basically just did what he normally talks about like he's been all over the country like talking about stuff um I don't know if he's gonna run or not. Um, I I clearly do not like how he. Don't get me wrong. I'm not. I'm not against one side or the other. I'm just. Um, yeah, I don't like how he quoted China. Um, yeah, he said. Uh, yeah, he gave, like, the story of, um, he was in China and, um, talking to, uh, the president there, I guess. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce his name. Yeah, but, um, yeah, he, and I guess he was, like, talking about a drug, a drug problem or drug dealers or something, and I guess he's like, well... This is the uh, leader from China. Well, Donald Trump, like, said that. <laughs> yeah, so... I don't know if Donald Trump was, like, saying that this needs to happen here in the United States. Um, I seriously doubt it's ever going to happen here in the United States. Um, he said that uh, people in China that sell drugs, they go to... They go through a speedy um, trial, and then they um, and then they're executed. That's um, <laughs> do do what now? Um, you know what? That might be the law in China. Uh, yeah, I don't think that'll ever be the law here. Um, it doesn't matter how you feel about that about that sort of thing. It's yeah, I don't think that'll ever be the law here. Um, yeah, so, I don't know. It's, and he kept, like, uh, quoting, like, he said, the next president needs to do this, the next president. And I'm a big supporter of everything. I'm, I'm not, um, you know, I support Biden. I support uh, Donald Trump. Um, and... Yeah, how I, um, you know what, when it comes to election time, I, you know what, in the last election, I did not vote, um, that just was because, <laughs> I, I thought I had time to register to vote, but I didn't, so, and I was at work, and yeah, it's just, I just decided not to, so, um, yeah, but, yeah, alright, so where was I? Yeah, it was that, um, Donald Trump's like, yeah, the next president, if 
he's a uh, Republican, which he probably will be, and, um, yeah, he needs to do this, he needs to do that. You know what, if, um, the next president comes in, um, <laughs> and I, I say this with, uh, you know what, if the next president comes in, and it's not you, it's not Donald Trump, then, uh, you just need to shut the hell up. It's, um, <laughs> and, and I say that with the greatest respect in the world. Um, yeah, you know what? He's, what, he's gonna tell another president what to do? And, yeah, that's not how we do things here in America. Um, so, yeah, it's, um, uh, <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know how you guys feel about that, but, um, yeah, it's just, I mean, it's, The more and more that we're getting towards this election in 2022, the more and more I see that um, these Republicans are basically not stupid, just um, they're putting out dumb policies just like the Democrats are. And yeah, you just, I don't know. <laughs> so. Yeah, it's, it's kind of however you want to look at it. I mean, you know what? I, I feel that a president should go in there and do what he thinks is right, not what somebody tells him, you know? And, um, and also another thing is, um, <laughs> we're talking about politics now. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to try to keep this... Um, Without argument here and I could think of you know what um, as far as the NRA is concerned um, a lot of these politicians are being paid by these um, by the NRA they're um, and I don't think that's right it's um, I don't know if that falls under uh, bribing a public official, but it should. It's, you're basically paying them to say what you want to about your product. I, I think that's bribing a public official. That's, um, I, I don't know how to put it. But yeah, I don't know. It's, um, yeah, I don't know, it's weird. So, yeah, and a lot of these politicians are being paid by the, by these, um, well, by the, uh, NRA. And, yeah, I just, you know what, if you, if you're a politician, you shouldn't be paid by anybody. You should be paid by the taxpayers. That's your only line of pay. It's, it's just that simple. So, <laughs> so anyways, moving on, um. Okay, uh, did I forget anybody? Um, okay. Yeah, Nancy Pelosi is, um, I don't know if she's, um, I think she's going to Taiwan or something. Um, it's not clear if she is or not. Um, I guess that, um, somebody asked Biden the other, Biden the other day and, um, yeah, and he said that, um, you know, that, and he didn't give a clear answer, he just, um, kind of said that, um, you know, the Air Force doesn't think that she should go, um, you know what, you know what, if you put politics aside, and, if you put politics aside, Nancy Pelosi is kind of a badass, <laughs> she, she went to, um, she went to Ukraine, and during a, you know what's going on there. Yeah, she sat down with the president of Ukraine, and, um, I don't know what they talked about, but, yeah, she's, and, and it wasn't just Nancy Pelosi, I think, um, uh, Chuck Schumer, or, you know what, I'm not gonna say that, um, I don't know, I don't remember who went, but, yeah, it was, uh, Congress that went there, um, but, yeah, it's, um, 
I, I don't know how you feel about Nancy Pelosi. Um, a lot of people... You know what? A lot of people would like to see something new. And, yeah. They, yeah, they, they would just like to see something new. Um, that's all I'm going to say about that. Um, so, we have uh, cars. Here, I'm going to get a drink of water. So we have uh, cars. Um, and chips. So I guess that um, they're going to put a chip factory. Not not potato chips. Um, a, um, computer chips for like cars and things like that. Um, I guess. I think they're going to put it right here in Ohio. Um, I'm not sure about that, but... Yeah, I think... Um, I think that... They're, they're putting, like, a chip factory or something... In Columbus or between Columbus and... Or, I don't know, it's, like, on... Yeah, I think it's in Columbus, Ohio or something. Or That's what I heard. Um, but yeah, I heard that they're going to open up a chip factory somewhere in America. So, And uh, what this means is um, basically these stocks are... You know what? I'm not going to talk about the stocks. Uh, yeah, but it's probably going to be good for like cars and um, everything. Um I'm not really sure if, like, um, these chips have to go into, like, other things, too, like, um, trying to look around and see if I can see anything around my house. Alright, it, they have to go into other things, like, um, like your tablet or your smartphone or, uh, I'm not sure if your TV... Uh, yeah, your TV probably has a smart chip inside of it. I don't know what these chips do. I think they're like processors or... They're like processors or memory or... I think they're processors. Um, but yeah, they're like the size of your finger. Um, like almost the size of your tip of your finger. Uh, I would say it depends on what you buy or what you like I would imagine in a car it's probably a it's probably bigger in a car um but yeah I just want to talk about that a little bit um did you know in like some of these cars they have like heated seats in them but you have to wait to uh you have to wait for it to be updated with the car updated on the computer software with the car it's like i think uh tesla has it um oh, but why 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 would you do that for it's um yeah it's, you know what if something like you know what i think they make cars like this they have heated seats you just hit a button and it turns on the heated seats i don't i don't know why it has to go through a computer or I have no idea, so, <laughs> so yeah, I think it's, uh, pretty cool, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to talk about tonight, um, I really did not have enough to come here on the microphone with, and, um, now it's past almost 20 minutes now, so, so yeah, so yeah, I just thought I would give you guys a video this week, um, by the way, none of this is, um, this is just my opinion. It's not anything to take lightly. I do not want to see a bunch of comments on here saying, yeah. You know what? If you're going to leave a comment, leave a comment. Um, <laughs> you know what? If you leave a rude comment on here, and believe me, I have done this before, I've gotten... You know what? It was my first, like my second um, comment that I got on YouTube. 
And I thought that it was, uh, cool. And this guy had written something that was... It was on YouTube. This guy had written something that was just awful. And I just deleted his ass. And uh, I just got rid of him. So, <laughs> yeah. That same thing will happen to you if you leave a rude and nasty comment. Um, yes. Keep it clean. Um, keep it clean. You get to stay on here. Um, yeah, I don't... But, um, yeah, if you have a question or a... You know what, if you have an idea for this, uh, show, um, I would love to hear it in the comment section, um, and I might talk about it, um, I do this every Thursday, um, the, um, yeah, I'm moving towards the end here, so, the, uh, Thursdays is a podcast, a, uh, YouTube, um, podcast thing, um, Monday's video, oh yeah, and, um, Thursdays is going to be coming out at, like, um, 8 o'clock, 8.30, um, it's just because, you know, I have to work, um, I would like for these videos to be updated, even though in tonight's video is probably not updated, it, it has to be up to date, uh, otherwise, you know, it's like, with the podcast, uh, you're gonna hear this, like, a week out, um, like, a week after I talk about this, so, yeah, it's, um, so, yeah, I like to stay up to date, um, and, um, yeah, I have to work, um, and, you know what, I, I just want these, I'm trying to play around with the times to see what gets the better views at least on uh youtube with the podcast it'll come out um every friday and you might even get it a little bit earlier so yeah keep that in mind um might get it like three hours before midnight on friday so yeah keep that in mind um monday's video is just me doing whatever um and i am going to be here soon, add in like uh, two or three minute videos. Um, I don't know when that starts, but I'm still thinking of ideas to do it. Excuse me. To do with that. So, anyways, uh, that's my show. Um, thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. If you're watching on YouTube, uh, if you're watching on YouTube, please leave a like. Uh, hit that. Uh, subscribe button for more more videos just like this one and i'll see you guys next week all right thank you for watching have a good week